The season in every man's life is broken into four 25-year circles. There is a morning stage of every man's life, this represent the first 25 years of your life. Whether you are prepared or not, the first 25 years of every man's life represent the morning stage. This is a stage where you can make mistakes and go free, life will forgive you. There are certain things that would have happened to your destiny at that stage but at the time you are 25 and certain things have not happened, time is already against you. According to God expectation, by 25 years you should have found Jesus Christ, you should not be walking around trying to guess what salvation is no. By 25 you should be filled with the Holy Ghost. By 25 you should have mastered the keys of the kingdom. By 25, you should have built strategic destiny relationships. There are many people who got born again, they are already behind schedule of seasons. Someone of 18 years can be playing with his life, you who is 35, you are joining him to play, who is foolish. That person can play with his life and repent later on and still work within 25 years, and you, that time has already gone, you don't have that time again. First 25 years of your life, is a time for massive investment in your spirit. The next phase of your life is called the afternoon stage. The morning stage is a stage of learning. The afternoon stage is the stage of execution. It represents the next 25 years of your life. Which is from 26 to 50 years, that is not the stage of rehearsal. If you are still learning at that stage, you are behind time. You are merging two seasons in one, that means you need an extra grace from God. There are many people God is telling you right now, you missed the first 26 years of your life, you are in the second 25 years but you are still carrying over. It means you must pray more. Invest more time. An old man of 60 years is sleeping and you too are sleeping. Imagine someone who gets born again at 45. The time it will take you to know the Holy Ghost, the time it will take you to find a Bible-believing church, the time it will take you to know the principles of the kingdom. The evening stage, 50 to 75 years. This is the stage of legacy, where at this point, you are not trying to prove a point again. That is when you began to build institution that reflects your value. You are not successful until there is a generation that becomes loyal to your thought. You cannot mark your script and give yourself a grade. It is one generation that will tell us whether you were successful. Our success is proof that Jesus succeeded. It is the success of your children that show whether you succeeded. No matter what you are enjoying now, you are still a student. It is when someone, who comes out of you and now succeed, that's when we'll know you have succeeded. The stage of legacy. That's the stage when you turn back and begin to mentor and build a generation coming. Teaching them. Teaching them from your mistakes, passionately pouring your heart telling them, when you get here, even though it does not look like there is a hole, jump it. I did not know this when I was there and it cost me 10 years extra. There are young people who are sleeping 8 hours in one day. Let me give you an advice, if you sleep 8 hours out of 24 years, by the time you are 30 years, you have slept for 10 years of your life. And the final stage of your life, the last 75 years, is called the stage of rest, not death. If you started this journey completely, at age 75, you should almost be ready to finish your assignment.